whatever social media platform you're using, the advice I give to monetize it is the same for everyone. <laughs> Study it for two weeks. Spend like a half an hour a day scrolling through and seeing what hits your heart emotionally, like what makes you react, what makes you comment. So it's the yoga practice of, of Svati Siaya. You're studying yourself in order to understand how the algorithm works. Save anything that you like comment on or, or that gets you like feeling something or interacting with things. From there, um, depending on which social media channel you're using, you want to research what the most popular people who are doing what you do are doing <laughs> and then just copy what they're doing. And by that, I mean, don't literally copy and paste, but like share their stuff, comment on their stuff, write responses to their stuff. Um, for something like TikTok, you can like stitch together, you know, videos together because their audience is your audience. And so you want to start drawing this web of interacting with people using the work that's already out there. This is how we make the algorithm work for us really efficiently, right? Other people are already succeeding at this. Let's just copy what they're doing. And it's also supportive of them and the algorithm rewards that. For this type of work, there are, uh, there's a short, a medium and a long-term way to find clients. The short term is gonna be referrals. If you already had a proven product, like um, if you had like a course that you'd made six figures on, then the quickest way would be ads. But if you don't have proof of products, the ads aren't, aren't gonna work. You, you need a lot of um, confidence behind ads to make them work and it's not worth the money investment. So I would start with utilizing social media to ask for referrals. And through that, that's going to be in the DMs. That's going to be building relationships. Um, the medium term is, is going to be investing in social media channels. It just, it, any sort of launch that you do on social media, you need about six weeks to really see a significant return on investment. It's not the sort of thing where you can post a couple of times and people are like, yes, I want to hire you. What are you selling? You have to really warm up your audience on social media. So it can take six weeks to a couple of months, depending on which social media channel you're using and how much time you're willing to put into it. Uh, the the long-term way is going to be um, uh, licensing your work. As we discussed, like a, a course, an ebook, something where people can just buy it. It doesn't cost you any extra time. And Sarah just commented that live crystal meditations would be amazing on Insight Timer. Yes, and of course, that's what I was going to mention next. I have a, a course that uh, teaches you how to become a successful teacher on Insight Timer. I'm now calling it Passive Income Mastery because it's a place where you can license your work. So a couple of meditations, you start getting paid for them. It's a resource for everyone. You can release courses, they do all the marketing for you. And you can go live where you can start attracting people. It's a great funnel to attract people to this type of deep healing work because the people specifically on Insight Timer are there for healing work. And that's the problem we have with other social media channels like Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. People are there for distraction, not necessarily for deep healing. So that's why I like finding other social media channels with a community that's already like, no, I know, I know I've got a problem and I want a solution, right? To circle back to that basic marketing tenant. They're, all, they're actively looking for a solution. So I have a 30 day coaching program around that uh, where we spend that month getting that all set up for you so that you start making money from it immediately. And so that you um, can set up those long-term kind of passive income streams where you can really easily have an audience ready to buy whatever it is that you want to sell, whether it's one-on-one -on -one healing work, whether it's, you know, the actual crystals. I honestly think you could almost working within the confines of the promotional rules, they have strict promotional rules on there. You could almost treat it like a QVC where you're basically like just showing off your crystals and you're like, by the way, I sell them. Go check the link <laughs> in my profile. 